Hi and welcome back to my channel. Today we are continuing the storyline of Red Dead Redemption 2. So let's get going. I'm very excited. In the last video we had to look for John and he was attacked by wolves. So I hope he's still alive. And we're also still stuck in the snowy area where there are snowstorms and everything. So let's hope we're gonna make it out this time. I love how when you're walking through the snow you can actually see the place you walked. Like, it's like fresh snow, and yeah. Oh. Alright. Let's see what everybody's up to. What do we have in here? Here we have him and his horse. Can we talk to him? You okay in here, Charles? Alright. Considering. Well, try to rest that hand. Okay, well, try to stay warm. Alright. Oh, the horses are here. Ooh. Look at that blue eye. That's a pretty horse. Oh, I'm stuck between the horse. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> I'm actually stuck. <laughs> okay, I made it out. I like how these horses are just there. And he's enjoying time with his horse. Where's anybody else? I think this is like... Oh, there's an invisible wall. We can't. <laughs> we can barely get there. Alright, here's my horse. I don't know why my horse is out here and not inside. Let's bring my horse inside. He should also be um, be warm. I don't like my horse being outside. I can bring him in here, right? Hi. I got... Oh! The horses have, uh, have moved. Alright. I want you to be here. Oh no. I don't know if, if, if I was supposed to do this, but it's fine. My horse is inside now. Alright. Um, where's anybody else? There's a mission in here. I don't know which mission I want to do first. I want to see where everyone is first. There's a mission inside of here. Your... Hi. Morning, Arthur. How are you feeling? Not too bad, considering. Well, everybody seems alright. I mean, considering. They're not great, that's for sure. But considering, they're alright. Properly, Jose, uh, is this. You're the one oh. with the death wish. I am doing everything I can to keep these people alive. Pinkertons. Lots of them. And bounty hunters, too, more than ever before. And all after us, we were set up in Blackwater. And none of them. Dumb enough to take that pass in winter or think us fool enough to do it neither. We got a few weeks. By the time they find out where we are, we'll be gone. Where to? I ain't got that yet. <laughs> but this ain't where to? Nobody knows. No way. <laughs> He's passionate. Hi. <sighs> Sorry, I I ruined your dramatic exit, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to do that. Are you okay? You warned them about that Blackwater job. Yes, but who listens to me anymore? We oh, do. Oh, we'll work this out. Yeah. Well, just hang in there. And right, that person is just <laughs> reading a book. She's like, I'm not gonna get involved in this. <laughs> Where did he go? Oh, he's now over there. Is he talking? Is he just awkwardly standing there? That what's going on? I ain't sure how long we can realistically stay up here, Dutch. Oh, you don't start too. You're getting as bad as he is. Okay, well, we don't have to talk about this now. Alright, I guess he's in a bad mood. Alright, um, the horses are there. Hosea and the other woman are in there. Um, there are a few more houses here. There are no missions here, but I want to see where everybody is. Just to make sure they're okay. Who's in here? Oh. It's Someone's okay. crying. It's okay. You're safe now. Oh, that's one whose husband She'll died. Okay, I'm sure she will, Mary Beth. Alright, let's, let's, let's leave her to it. Oh, there's John. We saved him. Last mission. Are you okay? Hi, John. Hi. Morning. He needs a pillow. How are you doing? Okay, I guess. 
That's it. Try to stay positive. Good enough. It's been a nasty few days. Morning. Morning, Arthur. How are you holding up? I'm doing all right. Considering. <laughs> Considering. Well, we're all seem to be doing fine. Of course. Sorry, Mrs. Adler. What? How are you feeling? I, I don't know. No oblation. We'll be okay. Chooseth the tree that will care. not rot. Oh, okay. I'm sorry. He I'll leave. Unto him a cunning workman to and that's, uh, let's just do a mission. Uh, they're just going back inside. Is he gonna apologize for being so rude? Or are they just gonna argue again? Where? Where is the other chair? He removed Dutch's chair. He doesn't want to be involved with Dutch anymore. He's like, you're not gonna sit next to me. We're sitting ducks. You think I don't know that? I'm just worried. Everyone's worried. Show some faith. Can I? Can I reassure you? Hey. How are you doing? I've had better days. <laughs> I can imagine. Alright, let's just uh, do a mission because everybody's miserable. <laughs> Maybe we can help by actually doing stuff. Let's go to um, to the horse guy. Is it the horse guy? I mean, he's in the shed next to the horses, so maybe he's a horse guy? I don't know. Hi. <coughs> oh. He doesn't sound so good. Here, Mr. Morgan. We're okay. We have a few cans of food and a rabbit. For what? 10, 12 people? When I was in the Navy. I, yeah, that's I not much. I hear about what you got up to in the Navy, Mr. Pearson. We were stranded at sea for 50 days. And you unfortunately survived. When we ran away from Blackwater, I wasn't able to get supplies in. Well, when government agents are hunting you down, sometimes shopping trips need to be cut short. We'll survive. We always have. And if needs be, we can eat you. You're the fattest. I sent Lenny and Bill hunting, and they found nothing. Well, Lenny's more into book learning than hunting. Bill's a fool. Unless those mountains are full of game that want to read, ain't no wonder they found Enough nothing. of this. We'll go find something. Come on, Arthur. Aren't you injured? Wait a second. Hold on. Uh, here. You're gonna need something to eat out there. Assorted salted offal. <laughs> Starving will be preferable. Come on, let's go. You can't go hunting. Look at your hand. I can't stay here listening to you two. Look at this game in those hills, I'll find it. And you can kill it. You need to rest, Charles. You think this is rest? It's not gonna listen to you. Come along. I mean, I have to agree with them. They they do need to eat. <coughs> They're gonna need some food. Here, you take this. I can't use it, and you'll have to. Oh, you're joking. Use a gun, and we'll scare off every animal for miles around. You're never too old to learn. I imagine. We're not oh, old, I think. How old are we? I'll have to Google that. It seems to be less stormy, more you snowy. Up, I'm okay. Apart from this hand, this stupid mistake. Still bad. It'll be fine in a day or two. I just can't pull a bow right now. Uh, sure hope I can. Never really got the hang of it. You'll be fine. <sighs> so, you reckon we're gonna find something to kill? It ain't no Driscoll. There's meat up here for sure. Pearson doesn't know what he's talking about. Now the weather's eased off a bit, they'll be needing to feed. We'll head up this way, find some higher ground. <laughs> Been a wild few days, all right. That ride north from Blackwater, getting stuck in the storm, bringing John back in. You've had a lot put on you. I wish I could have done more. I didn't That's fine. Like that. Just glad to think back on. I still don't really know what happened on that boat. Me neither. Well, Javier, 
told me a bit, but it sure weren't good. Epic cutscenes. We love some epic cutscenes. They're great. I'm not gonna lie, it's really beautiful. This is good. It is. Come on, let's try this way. Keep your eyes peeled for movement. The wind's died down too. That's good. No wind at all is bad, but if it's too strong, they won't move. Now shh, stay quiet. Um, the horses are making noise though. Maybe the horses. The skies that we're here. Hey, stop here a second. Oh, I see something. Okay. We do need a bow, right? Can I can I get the bow, please? You've been here in recent night. How can you tell? How can you not? Well. There are footsteps, so you're gonna need the bow. Don't leave it on your horse. Now I can get it. There we go. Keep down. Move quietly and slowly. Are you not coming with me? I have to go alone. Oh, okay. Well, we'll just follow these tracks, I guess. You see the tracks? Uh, I think so. Maybe not. Focus. Oh, that's pretty cool. All right. There are people like building something, I think, like with a hammer. And it sounds like knocking. So every time they make that noise, I feel like someone's knocking on a window or on my door or something. And I'm like, I have a doorbell. You can just ring the doorbell if you need me. But I don't think they're trying to knock on the door. Oh, I see something. I think they're just. I said slow and quiet, Arthur. Oh, oh, sorry. I was just talking about someone knocking. <laughs> oh, sorry. All right, there it is. Can I reach this from here? I should be. It's pretty close. Oh, I need a bit, a bit closer. Down there. Sorry, sorry. You see him? I see him. Are you ready with that bow? Can I do this? Aim for their head or neck. Nice. <gasps> oh my god, I got it! That's insane! First try. I'm insane. I'm actually insane. Holy, how did I do that? Well, can we do it again? That's the question. <laughs> I did it once. I don't know if I can do it again. That was pretty amazing. Felt good. They're on the other side of the of the river. Pretty far away. I don't know if I can do it a second time, especially if they're that far away. But um, well, you never know. Is it walking away? I don't know. It seems so far away. They're right there. Okay, I can do this. I can do this, right? And there. Got it. Well done. Oh, oh my god, that's so good. I got it. I got them both first try. That's amazing. Sure your hands okay? it'll be fine once I get it on my shoulder. Okay, I'll go grab the other one. Walk on with you. You don't have to go get it alone. My horse can uh, come this way. You wanna scare the other deer though. He's just running towards it, and the deer's like, nah, I'm fine. <laughs> you can take my friend, it's fine. I'm gonna get this packed on my horse. Why is my horse here yet? Oh, there they are. Look at us. Hunting buddies. His horse is faster than mine. That's Oh, that's the horse we, 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 we took out first time. In the first mission. That's his horse. What happened to- Why, why didn't we have a horse before? Let's get out of here. Because we got this horse 
Oh, other way. We got this horse from that um, from the shed in the party, from the barn. I don't know. Didn't we have a horse before? Like there's been storyline before this, right? I'm so confused. I knew you'd be okay with that bow. Oh, thank you. Some more thaw. Mm, you're probably right. Yeah. And even if we do get off here, what then? We still have a big price on our heads. This is a big country. We'll find somewhere to lie low. Yeah, we'll just have to find a new place. The shows they are like the boss of the gang, I guess. You notice how Pearson's had a bottle in his hand ever since we fled Blackwater? We give the camp cook five minutes to grab the essentials and go, and he doesn't even bring a crumb of food. Good that we caught more than one. A lot of mouths to feed. And that girl from the ranch now, too. But the ranch, that's sure it. That's where we got the horse. She has a wild look in her eye. You would, too. I mean, she her husband just got kills. And her home. I might go. So what do we do with her? Once we get out of here and we're back on our feet, we'll see. She might have family somewhere. So it was O'Driscoll's you ran into there? Yeah. <laughs> Last thing we was expecting. What is it with your O'Driscoll's? You ain't dealt with them? I suppose. Hell, we ain't run into them much the last six months. I guess because they've been over this way. Yeah. I've heard a lot of talk about them. Well... We've been scrapping over stores with them for years. Big gang. Nasty sons of bitches. Their leaders uh. comb and Dutch go way back. And not in a good way. A proper blood feud. So I heard. Okay. So they're like enemies, I guess. Dutch and Colm. And the other schools. Bear up ahead. Ew. Let's see if we can find <laughs> There's also a dog right next to me with a toy. He's like, can you play with me? He's got a lot of meat on him. <laughs> Sorry, I can't play with you right now. <laughs> we can even carry it. Our Stay horses are like. Spring storms like this are the worst for animals that sleep all winter. My dog is like, oh, my wife is scared of the bear. I'm sorry. It's all oh, right, boy. Yeah, you're fine. He's like staring at me with a toy and <laughs> wagging his tail. And he's like, can you play with me, please? Never please. That much, <laughs> you, How long you been with us now? Five, oh, he's new. Months? Oh, well, Something kind of new. Like six months new. This. What? Any of this. Blackwater mess. Being up here? Ah, sooner or later a job's gonna go wrong. Nature of life. I just thought you might have moved on by now. You want me to move on? No. No, no not at all. I just we both like no. You could run it alone, no problem. I did that for a long time. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm done with it. Uh, careful. Always wondering if someone's gonna kill you in your sleep. I still wonder that most nights. <laughs> I reckon you're okay. This suits me. Sure, I could fall in with another gang, but Dutch. You know, Dutch is different. Oh, yes. Dutch is certainly different. He treats me fair. Most of you do. But for a fellow with a black father and an Indian mother, that ain't normally the case. Well, we need you now. More than ever. Good. How long have you been with these boys? Why ain't you run off? Me? Oh, 20 years, something like that. 
Since I was a boy. Years. He grew up yeah. with them. Taught me to read. Oh, there's just like John a father. Taught me a few other things. Him and Hosea. So Dutch and Hosea are like sure. um Arthur's Let's fathers. See. Kind of. Most of and John That's too. So John's like his brother. Well like make family. Right. That's so sweet. How's that new horse? He's alright. He'll do for now. I appreciate you letting me take Taima the other night. She's a strong one. It's been as hard on the horses as on the rest of us. I don't know what Dutch would do if something happened to the Count. Same with Bill and Brown Jack. He's a drunk, miserable bastard, but Aww. he loves that horse. <laughs> I hope they all make it. I tried to ride the Count once. Fuck me faster than a bull. Won't take nobody but him. That's so sweet. I love how in the game they also have like the horses also have a personality and like their owners and here. that's amazing. So much detail. Want some food back, boys. Yeah. Come on, let's get these over to Pearson. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Thank you for showing me how to use the bow properly. I only showed you a little. It takes a lifetime of practice to master. I can imagine. Sorry, I was <laughs> running into you with the deer. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to. Is your yeah, you're not using your hands. It's fine. Here you go. What a surprise. <laughs> Just drop <laughs> from the kitchen. Is that any way to greet an old friend? I feel like we haven't spoken for days. I do my utmost to avoid. Why, he loves me really. It's his sad way of showing affection. No, it isn't. Now shoot. Just drop that. See you gents later. See, you got on just fine. Charles is a wonder. Have a drink, boys. Urine. Oh, so funny. Jesus, what is that? Navy rum, sir. It's the only thing. The only thing. <laughs> I Keeps guess. Keeps you sane, it does. Yeah. Oh. Seems to have done a treat on you. you yeah, I'm not sure hand, if it Charles. keeps you sane, you're actually. You mind helping me with the skinning, Mr. Morgan? It's easier if we do it together. Do I get to skin you? <coughs> you're always one with the jokes, aren't you? Come on. This really isn't a job for a man with a burnt hand. I'll see you both later. You skinned that one you just dumped on the floor there. All right. We can do that. Skin, skin. Ooh, he's actually skinning it. That's gross. Huh. Weren't you gonna skin the other one? Mr. Morgan. Yeah. They always said you were a butcher. Uh, you know, you could trade these and sell these in pretty much any town. If you're looking to make a legitimate bit of money, of course. Right now, I'm just looking to get off this mountain alive. Well, if you catch anything else, you bring it to me. Sure. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Heck, Arthur Morgan's first decent bit of hunting after all these years. Yeah, well, we're on the run now. Everyone's got to do their bit to survive. We'll make the yeah, we need to eat. Folk need it. In a tough few days. <gasps> and it's very cold. All right, let's get our horse inside as well. Because he's getting cold. All right, boy. Come on. Let's get you. Oh, the barn's over there. Never mind. Let's get you warm, and then we can finish our video. Oh. Hi. Just bring my horse inside. Oh, he's not here. The last time he was here, but he's not this time. Can I pet you? I can. Yeah. Anyway, this is where we're gonna end the video. I hope you enjoyed it. I certainly did. If you wanna see more, please consider subscribing. I would love that. And um, leave a like if you enjoyed the video. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope I'll see you next time. Bye, guys. Bye.